The Congress government in Karnataka has taken a step in fulfilling another promise listed in its manifesto. Chief Minister Siddharamaiah has decided to implement the old pension scheme, which was, of course, the biggest political plank of the Congress government. Here's the report. Karnataka Chief Minister Siddharamaiah has announced implementation of the old pension scheme. Eight months after the Congress made a promise in its election manifesto. 13,000 government employees will come under the old pension scheme or OPS that provides a monthly pension, nearly half the last drawn salary. This will include those notified before April 1, 2006 but appointed at a later date. The new pension scheme diverts a portion of the salary to the pension fund and a one-time lump sum is offered on superannuation. Aisha Noor working as a senior assistant in the Karnataka Legislative Assembly, is among the 13,000 employees happy that her financial challenges after retirement have been addressed. As a government official, I'm very much happy that uh, we'll be benefited with this OPS compared to NPS. We had uh, placed the request before the government, so they have accepted the request and as per their uh, manifesto also, they're giving the same thing to us. But lakhs of government employees who came into government service before 2006 and after May 2023 still fall under the new pension scheme. Ghana Sarkar ke mane Mukhya Mantri ke adhikari ke na ni sandar dali krutak na tegala na Sarkari na ukra pravag na salistik bhaisane. Haage innu kuda yeladu vare lakshya chana NPS na ukra irajch dali dare. Par OPS swaptik tarbe ka giran to to kuda Sarkar jawdhari agira. Samay aukasha galan kudbe ka akta den onto do. Yalla Sarkar galu barvasa kotu. Adi is Sarkar mele ondishto namikya bandhe karana manifesto dal yeli onto karan kaagi. The Karnataka government seems to be adopting a dual policy regarding the pension. The old pension scheme as well as the new pension scheme. The Karnataka government is already financially burdened with the guarantee schemes. And will this cause additional burden ahead of the budget? With camera person Govan Pratibaraman in Bengaluru for NDTV.